Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Let us continue to worship God. As we sing this chorus, you don't have to say the lamb anymore. You don't have to put the blood stain on the door. For someone has taken the place of the lamb. And it's Jesus. The grave and Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. You don't have to slay the lamb anymore. You don't have to put the blood stain on your door. For someone has taken the place of the lamb and it's Jesus the
Samuel, we be coming to pray God divine leading and the rest of the service. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. We worship your name, Jesus. We praise your name, Lord. We glorify your name, Jesus, the one worthy. And worthy you are to be praised from the bright of the sun and to the face of the day. There is no God like Jehovah. God, the one great is thy faithfulness, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. the victory again and again. God, as we come before you, God, we acknowledge you as the conquering Savior, that God will break every chain this morning. And as we come this morning, we ask you to break every chain that opposes your word, that as it goes forth, God, it will accomplish what it must accomplish. God, we ask you this morning uh, to take authority uh, of everything, God, uh, that will end uh, your word uh, from going forth this morning. We declare that you are God in this place. You are the conquering. Hallelujah. God, you are the conquering Savior. God, that will break every chain. Mighty God of Daniel. God, to God, we declare the victory. God, we declare the victory despite the opposition. Come on, church. Despite the opposition. God, despite the opposition that the enemy would want to throw, that your word will not go forth. Come on, church. God, you are the conquering Savior. And we declare you break every chain. God, and we know you give us the victory. Come on, church. Though the enemy think <laughs> that he is victorious, but come on, church. Oh, come on, church. It was foretold years ago that a day like this would be coming. For God, we know that you are the conquering Savior. So despite what the enemy think this morning, come on, church. Come on, church. Come on, church. Despite what the enemy think this morning, we know that God is the conquering Savior. God, and we know that you break every chain. God, we know that you break every chain. Come on, church. We will not sit back, but we will stand upon your word. Because it must accomplish what it must accomplish. Can you put all you know them the conquering Savior. Break every chain this morning. And give us the victory. Come on, church. The enemy thought that he shut us up. But come on, church. God has already warned us. God has already armed us with knowledge. And we know that he break every chain. So we thank you this morning for your victory. God, we thank you for your victory this morning. We thank you for your victory. God, we are not here to please man this morning. Come on, but man must know that you are God. And perfect so you think that you shut up God. Come on, you cannot shut up God. Come on, people of God. He is the conquering chain. Mighty God. He break every chain. He has the power of hell. He conquered death. 
the victory. Again and again. We bless your name, Jesus. We honor you. We exalt you. Come on, church. Come on, church. One shall chase a thousand, church. Mighty God. One shall chase a thousand. Oh, come on, church. One shall chase a thousand. And we are more than conquerors. Come on, church. So we take authority over the things of the devil. And we declare that we are more than conquerors. In Jesus' name. God bless you. God bless you. Amen. Name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise God. Today our theme is fellowship with God through the blood of Jesus. But today as we come, we know that Jesus Christ shed his blood. And today we just want to worship him. Sister Betty, if you may come in, read the first lesson for us. Come on, magnify the name of Jesus. Praise the name of the Lord. Our first lesson will be taken from St. Luke 24, reading from verse 13 to 35. I'll read as well follows. St. Luke 24, verses 13 to 35. And I'll begin. And behold, two of them went that same day to a village called Emmaus, which was from Jerusalem, about three score furlong. And they talked together of all these things which had happened. And it came to pass that while they communed together and reasoned, Jesus himself drew near and went with them. But their eyes were holding that they should not know him. And he said unto them, What manner of communication are these that ye have one to another, as ye walk, and are sad? And the one of them, whose name was Cleophas, answering, said unto him, Art thou wholly a stranger in Jerusalem, and hast not known the things which are come to pass there in these days? And he said unto them, What things? And they said unto him, Concerning Jesus of Nazareth, which was a prophet, mighty in deed and word before God and all the people, and how the chief priests and our rulers delivered him to be condemned to death, and have crucified him. But we trust that it had been he which should have redeemed Israel. And beside all this, today is the third day since these things were done. Yea, and certain women also of our company made us astonished, which were hurly at the sepulchre. And when they found his body, they came saying that they had also seen a vision of angels which said that he was alive. And certain of them which were with us went to the sepulcher and found it even as, sorry, found it so as the woman had said, but him they saw not. Then he said unto them, O fools, and slow of heart to believe all that the prophet has spoken. Ought not Christ to have suffered these things and to enter into his glory? And beginning at Moses and all the prophets, he expounded unto them in all the scriptures the things concerning himself. And they drew nigh unto the village whither they went, and he made as though the, he would have gone further. 
But they constrained him, saying, Abide with us, for it is toward even, and the day is far spent. And he went in to tarry with them. And it came to pass, as he sat at meat with them, he took bread and blessed it, and brake and gave to them. And their eyes were opened, and they knew him, and he vanished out of their sight. And they said one to another, Did not our heart burn within us while he talked with us by the way, and while he opened us to the scripture? And they arose up the same hour, and returned to Jerusalem, and found the eleven gathered together, and them that were with them, saying, The Lord is risen indeed, and hath appeared to Simon. 35 and last. And they told that thing, sorry, and they told that things were done in the way, and all he was known of them in breaking of bread. Here ended the portion of God's holy word. We honor it by saying, Amen. Hebrews 10, from verse 19 to 25. Hebrews 10, from verse 19 to 25. I'll read while you follow. Having therefore a brethren boldness to enter into the holiest by the blood of Jesus, by a new and living way which he has consecrated for us, through the veil that is to say his blood, and having a flesh, and having an high priest over the house of God. Let us draw near with a true heart in full assurance of faith, having our hearts sprinkled from an evil conscience, and our bodies washed with pure water. Let us hold fast the profession of our faith without wavering, for he is faithful that promise. And let us consider one another to provoke unto the love and to good work. 22 and last, not forsaking the assembling of ourselves together has the manner of some his, but exhorting one another, and so much the more has he see the day approaching. Here in the reading of God's all the word, we all honor them by saying glory. Amen. Praise God. Thank you and back to our moderator, Evangelist Thompson, in the name of the Holy Ghost. Lift up his name and to honor him. Amen. Amen. Know that we are the children of the Lord. Amen. It's the children of the Lord Amen. of our right to shout and sing. Amen. We praise his name. Praise Amen. So we have that right to shout and to sing and to make a joyful noise unto the King and the God of our salvation. Amen. Amen. So this morning as we come, we Give honor and praise unto the Almighty God. Amen. Who have given us life and life abundantly. We praise his name. Amen. Thank you, Sister Russell. Amen. For doing the first part of our service for us. And thanks to praise and worship team. Amen. As we worship God. Amen. Together. Today in the beauty of holiness. Amen. And today we just want to give God thanks. Amen. Amen. For his grace and love towards us. We praise his name. Amen. And we want to greet our pastor. Amen. Pastor H. Thompson. Amen. The man of God. Amen. Greeting in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And those who are here this morning. Greeting in the precious name of our Lord and Savior. And wherever you are this morning, 
Greetings to you. Amen. Let keep our eyes on Jesus. Amen. For we keep our eyes on him. Amen. Somebody said, look. Amen. Don't gaze, but look. Amen. We praise his name. And he said, there is life or a look of the crucified one. There is life of this moment. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. You save. What all we have to do is to look unto him. We praise the name of the Lord. We praise the name of the Lord. So today we come, amen, to give glory and honor to the God of our salvation. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. So we are going to sing and we are going to shout and we are going to open our mouth and amen, give praises to God for all that he has done for us. We praise the name of the Lord. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. For he has given us life this morning. Amen. And amen. There are many do not have this opportunity to be in the house of God. So we see how important it is. Amen. That when amen, we have that amen opportunity to fellowship together. Amen. Then we make full use of it. We praise his name. And he said we should not forsake the assembling of one to another. We praise his name. Amen. amen. So as we come, amen, as few in number, we praise his name. We just want to make our voice be heard tonight. Amen. That the God of our salvation is still alive. Amen. And the church door is still open. We praise the name of the Lord. And the people of God, amen, have the right to send up praises unto God. We praise the name of the Lord. So let us not keep quiet, amen, those of us who are here this morning. But let us, amen, send our praises unto God. Jehovah, the rock of our salvation. We praise the name of the Lord. We praise the name of the Lord. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. At this time, we are going to ask for the monthly to bless the day's tithes and offering. We praise his name. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. And those at home who cannot come, amen. Remember, your tithes and offering is important. We praise his name. We praise the name of the Lord. So at this time, Brother Mundel, we give time to us these tithes and offering. Praise the name of Jesus. Everyone, please stand. Hallelujah. We worship you, God. We praise you. We magnify you and we glorify you. You are the King of kings. You are the Lord of lords. You are the conquering lion of the tribe of Judea. You break every chain. You break every fetter. You set captive free. This morning, God Almighty, we want to thank you for this wonderful day. This lovely day, this day that you have given to us that we could worship you and to praise you. Mighty God, we want to thank you, God, for this, oh God, this day that, Lord, as we come. Mighty God, as your people are about to stretch forth, oh God, the tithes and the half and that you have blessed them with. We pray, God Almighty, that, oh God Almighty, those that have to give, Lord, we pray, mighty God, that you bless them. But remember those that, Lord, do not have to give, but have the will in mind to give, Lord. We pray, God Almighty, that you provide for them, that they can have to give for the furtherance of your work. Bless it, Lord. Sanctify it and consecrate it, Lord, as we place it into your hands. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In the name of the Lord. Praise his name. Amen. And also the bus in three months from the amen. We will not be swore, God the stone is rolling. We will not God the tomb is empty. We pray to the name of the Lord. Amen. We pray to the name of the Lord. Amen. God will live forevermore. Amen. We pray to the name of the Lord. Amen. We pray to the name of the Lord. Amen. Because he is not dead. Amen. He is not in the tomb this morning. Amen, but we be resurrected from the dead. We pray to the name of the Lord.
Amen. Of peace and fellowship with God. Hallelujah. What a day to be alive. Let's be the name of Jesus. Thanks be to God. He's great, he's wonderful, and he's altogether lovely. Hallelujah. This will be the name of the Lord. Praise his name. Let me greet you. Well, all of us that are blessed to be here today. Amen. And those at home, say amen wherever you are, around the house. Amen. Praise God. I pray God, amen, that you'll be able to join in with us so that we can still have fellowship. Hallelujah. Praise God. Because uh, the blood of Jesus Christ, his son, cleanses us from all our sins. Praise God and give us this wonderful access to the throne of God so that we can have fellowship with God and with one another. What a blessing. Hallelujah. Oh, praise his name. Oh, praise God. Amen. Praise his name. And so I pray God that you have been enjoying. Amen. Praise God. Amen. The days. Amen. Coming up to this great resurrection Sunday. Amen. We give the Lord thanks. Praise his name. And we still give the Lord thanks for this platform. Amen. Praise his name. In which we are able still to reach. Amen. Many. But of course, as we practice to say we are few. And as we only can be 12 in the house of worship. Amen. Praise God. We say we are few. But I want to. Amen. Say to us. Amen. Praise God. Let us look at the wider field. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise God. It's a platform, amen, that we can be even more, praise God, amen, than when we're coming out in full number. Praise God. Because, of course, so many can access, so many can, amen, praise God. Amen. Praise His name. Find place, find space, amen, in their own homes. Clap your hands and give the Lord thanks. Hallelujah. Clap your hands and give the Lord thanks. Hallelujah. He's good, he's great, he's mighty, he is everlasting. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise his name. And so today, amen. Praise God. I'm so glad. Amen. The song, amen. Praise God. I'm not excluded for what I am included. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Sometimes ago, amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise his name. And some of the dispensation. We could have said that we were not included. Hallelujah. To be the name of the Lord. Praise God. We were excluded. Praise his name from this. Hallelujah. That is why even when Jesus Christ came in and preached the gap. Amen. Praise God. Even with his twelve that were with him, there were a concern as there were a misunderstanding as there were still prejudice and pride. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God. But the draw illustration to help Peter to understand something. What I God have cleansed. Let no man call common or unclean. Hallelujah. Come on brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise God. Another place then. We have seen where praise God. Amen. Paul. Amen. He wrote and he really allows to understand that he is least, he is less, he is last of the apostles. Hallelujah. To be the name of the Lord. Yet because of the blood of Jesus. Amen. That reaches in and turn him around. Transform his life. Hallelujah. Come on friends. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Praise God. He could have withstood Peter. Amen. Praise his name. Because Peter at one point was drawing himself aside. Amen. Praise his name. Come on brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise God. Come on. Praise his name. Praise God. Holding unto some tradition. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Come on, church. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. But thank God today. Amen. Praise God in house. Amen. And at your home, wherever we are, worldwide. Amen. Praise God. The door has been swung open. Amen. And praise God. If one can say, My God, thank God I'm not excluded. Thank God I am not excluded. I am included. Hallelujah. In redemption plan. In redemption plan. Amen. I'm included. Praise his name. Praise God. To be with the Lord. Amen. I'm included. Blessed be the name of Jesus. The benefits 
Amen. That come through the blood of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Praise his name. Praise God. And of course, amen. Praise his name. Uh, a brief one today. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Praise his name. Amen. Praise his name. A brief one today. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. I could use the hallelujah. Amen. Praise his name because it's a long time ago. Amen. Praise God. Church of God, people don't love nothing too long. Oh, praise his name. In the name of Jesus. <laughs> oh, praise his name. Amen. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Oh, blessed be the name of the Lord. But we give the Lord thanks throughout the month of March coming into April. Amen. We have some wonderful teams. Amen. That have come to us. Amen. Praise God. I just briefly remind us of these teams. Amen. From we have started. Amen. The month of March. Hallelujah. Praise God in the month. Amen. Or in the season of Lent. Amen. Praise his name. Then we have these lovely teams that have come to us. Amen. Praise God. I believe the first one. Amen. Was that of course we're reminded that we should know our enemy. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Knowing your enemy. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Praise God in which we look at. Amen. To the problems here with Adam and Eve. Amen. The enemy are very deceptive. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Then of course we have God grace. Amen. Is unlimited. Hallelujah. Praise his name and all the great words that go with it. The unlimited grace of God. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. We are included because of the unlimited grace of God. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. The grace that knows no boundaries. Hallelujah. And that was Peter's problem was drawing line and drawing boundary. Amen. But of course, amen. Come on. Amen. Praise God. The man of God said, come on, come on, shake up. Amen. Get it in your system. Get it in your spirit. Amen. That this is, amen, the age of grace and deliverance by redemption through the blood of Jesus Christ. No segregation. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Then we have, of course, sincere faith. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Sincere faith. We need that faith. Amen. To really go on in these times, difficult times, trying times. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Our faith has to be sincere. Else we are going to be, amen, find ourselves in trouble. Amen. Bowing to all kinds of circumstances. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. But since your faith, amen, in the midst of death, amen, will say like Paul, amen, don't tell me not to go up to Jerusalem. Amen. Because I'm not only ready, amen, to be killed. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters, to be bound, but also to be killed. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. His faith in God. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Since your faith. Amen. And we'll have the lovely story from the book of Daniel. Amen. And so on. With, of course, his friends down there in Babylon. Hallelujah. Since your faith. Even. If our God who will serve, amen, will not deliver us, we will not bow. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. And I'm saying this to us here and at home, wherever you are. Amen. That is one thing I know. Amen. Praise his name. Hallelujah. I'm not a prophet. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. I never tried to be one. Hallelujah. But the Lord give unto the church prophets. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. It's one thing I know. And I want to encourage us. Amen. That all that is going on. Amen. For us the church of God. For us the blood washed one. For us. Amen. That have been saved by the grace of God. Should not be frightened. Amen. Amen. And we must understand some things. That there is something that is about to happen. Hallelujah. Come on brothers and sisters. There is something. That is about to happen. Not know when, we do not know how. But all I know, amen, when the church have been going through these trials, testing, amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Test of faith, hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. There is something that is about to happen. And there's one thing I am assured of. 
Amen. That what ever is about to happen will bring glory to God. Amen. Will bring man, amen, women, boys and girls to their knee in submission to the King of glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. So don't worry about the pride and don't worry about the amen, the thing that they have the enemy is doing. Amen. Somebody said when they heard that, of course, we should go into the station. Amen. Praise God to submit names and so on. Amen. And they felt embarrassed. No. Amen. I want to encourage you today. Amen. Praise his name. All of this is taking place. Yes. Amen. But our God will triumph. Amen. Praise his name. So I don't show, I don't know. Amen. What is out there? Amen. And when it will be taking place, whether today, tomorrow. Amen. But one thing I know from Bible prophecy is that God is about to do something that will change. Amen. Praise God the world. Amen. That will brought people to their knees in bowing to Jehovah and confess that he is Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. Even at his crucifixion, they mocked him, they adjured him. They said, if you be the son of God, amen, come down. My God, save yourself and save us. Come on, church of God. Hallelujah. But he humbled himself as a servant, amen, to redeem you and me. Hallelujah. Let's be the name of the Lord. But not until, amen, that great, amen, praise God. Come on, brothers and sisters, things happen. Hallelujah. Amen. The veil were rent. Darkness come upon the land. Amen. Praise God. We hear the cry. Surely he was the Son of God. Something is about to happen, church. Man must know that he is the Son of God. Man must know that he is the Redeemer of the world. Man must know. Amen. Praise God that he triumphed over death and hell. And he reigns supreme forever. Hallelujah. He reigns. He reigns. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Then we have, of course, amen, the finished work of the cross. Hallelujah. What a great team. Amen. Praise his name. The finished work of the cross. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. Then we have, amen, praise God. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Praise God in Good Friday. I am the resurrection. I am the life. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Today we are looking at, amen, fellowship. Hallelujah. With God through the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. My God. Fellowship with God. Amen. Through the blood of Jesus. What a time. Amen. And we must understand it. Amen. It's time to fellowship. Amen. At home. Fellowship at home. Amen. Draw your children. Draw your friends. Draw your neighbors. Oh, blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, brothers and sisters. Amen. When I say draw your neighbors, they don't even have to come over. Amen. But right there, amen, you can share the link. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. And where we can have fellowship. Hallelujah. One with another. Amen. As we were told, the writer to the Hebrews that we should fellowship. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, praise his name. So it's a great team. And of course, amen, might come in a neutral way. Praise his name. Even from the reading of the book of St. Luke. It's well known and I've read, amen, of, amen, been read so many times. Amen. Praise his name. And we might have noticed that, uh, amen, praise God, have left out, amen, the verses that would speak directly, amen, praise God, of the resurrection. Amen. Because we know it so much. Amen. Because today, amen, I want us to look in fellowship. Amen. And I want us to look at the Amos Road experience. Amen. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. I want us to understand something that we are included. Hallelujah. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Oh, praise God. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise his name. Amen. Praise God. And so, brothers and sisters, amen. Praise his name. Fellowship with God. To the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My God. You know, I think about it when we start on this teaching. Amen. The power of the blood. Hallelujah. Praise his name. I think about it. Amen. Praise his name. My God. The blood is so important. Amen. 
I thought about it, brothers and sisters. Amen. Even nowadays. Amen. Praise his name. Well, of course, it's from a long time. Amen. It's a long time. This is around. Amen. Where we have fathers at time for sake. Amen. The children are, we said, this whole them beginning. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. Praise God. But of course, there's a way to prove. Amen. That this child. Amen. Praise his name. Male or female belongs to this person. Amen. Our persons. Amen. Let's be the name of the Lord. Present is true the blood. Come on, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Let's be the name of Jesus. It is true the blood. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Amen. Also, amen. I think about it. Amen. Praise God. I've been hospitalized. Amen. And these things do take place. And there are some of us that have the experience. Amen. Praise his name. And of course, amen. You have to check out your blood type. Come on, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. The blood type of the checkout. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Come on, church of God. My God, but when we think of the blood of Jesus. My God, my God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. The book of Acts, amen. Praise his name. 1726, he said, Amen. God of created of all nations. Amen. Of the world of one blood. <laughs> My God. One blood. It's a mystery. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise the, the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. Praise his name. This blood works amidst our blood type. Come on, brothers and sisters. This blood works amidst our blood type. Hallelujah. This blood can apply. Amen. Praise God amidst our blood type. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. We need to understand, amen, praise God, the benefit, amen, praise his name of the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise his name. So praise God, I still want to think and think of fellowship, hallelujah, fellowship, amen, praise his name. When we think of fellowship, amen, praise God, then of course likely we think of time spent together, amen, praise his name. Some, for some person it's a it's a good time drinking and having fun. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name for some of us, and it should be for us in church. Amen. Time spent together in Bible study. Amen. Speaking and studying and sharing. Amen. The word of God. Amen. Praise his name. Praise his name. But overall, amen. Praise God. It's time spent enjoying. Amen. The company of each other, our friends. Amen. amen. Fellowship is really, amen, closeness, a friendship. Amen. amen. It's close. It's a friendship. Amen. amen. That when we, amen, praise God, that's what we have with God. Amen. And we should understand that. But it was bought with a price. Amen. This is what we now have with God. But we must always remember, amen, amen. this come about with a price. Amen. Meaning that, look here, let us do our best not to grieve the Holy Spirit of God. Amen. That will displease Him after He had redeemed us from our sins. Amen. Praise God. In going back to the beggarly element, in going back into the wages of sin. Amen. And His trespasses. Amen. Because the blood is powerful enough to wash and to cleanse and to keep us. Amen. Praise God. As the children out there at home, praise His name. Remember, there is no excuse. Since Jesus Christ has gone to the cross. Amen. Praise his name. Since he have used the word. Amen. Praise his name. The 19th chapter of John. The 30 verse. It is finished. There is no excuse. Come on brothers and sisters. Amen. Let's be the name of the Lord. Praise his name. No excuse. It's only for me. For you to understand. Amen. Praise God. The Bible verse of the scripture. Amen. Praise his name. Praise his name. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. Praise his name. The problem is the belief. Amen. The problem is really, praise God, to accept. Hallelujah. Praise God. Because if we go down in that well-known passage, then we would have understand that God did not send Jesus to condemn the world. He did not send Jesus to divide us. Amen. Praise his name. He sent Jesus to draw us nigh to him as the word of God. By his blood, 
We are being night to God. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Come on, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Bless your name, Lord. Praise his name. Praise his name. And so we have seen that, of course, in that same scripture, St. John 3. Amen. Praise his name. Praise God. 16 going to 17, 18. Hallelujah. Praise God. God did not send his son to condemn the world, but that the world through him, praise God, might be saved. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Praise God. Not to destroy life, but to give life. Hallelujah. But of course, as the scripture be continue to say, Amen. Praise God. Amen. This is condemnation. That light, light, light. Come on, church. Light of coming to the world. Yet men rather darkness more than light. Hallelujah. Come on. Praise his name. Come on. Amen. The sin darkness is the worst of all darkness. Hallelujah. Praise God. There is prophecy that is going around. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. And all that I see about it is that, of course, look here. When we hear these things, look up. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Whether it is pure or it is not. Amen. Praise God. But it's still an opportunity to look up. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise God. And many people concerned because it says three days of God. Come on, church of God. Many people can't turn over that. Amen. Praise his name. But I want to really, amen, encourage and I want to admonish, amen, praise God, us today, amen, that the worst darkness is sin darkness. Sin pit. Hallelujah. Let's have the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. We could have a blackout upon blackout. Amen. As long as we are connected, amen, to the source. Amen to Jesus. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Come on, brothers and sisters. He keep well with my soul. Hallelujah. Praise his name. That's what we need. Hallelujah. The light of the world is Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, praise his name. Praise his name. And what I also love, brothers and sisters, you cannot stop me. I cannot stop you. Oh, God. Help us, God. Hallelujah. You cannot stop me. Amen. Praise God. I cannot stop you. Amen. From entering. Amen. Into this marvelous light. Amen. Amen. From open in your heart's door. Amen. Praise God for confessing that Jesus Christ is my Lord and my Savior. My King. Hallelujah. Praise His name. Hallelujah. Praise His name. What a blessings. Amen. Praise His name. Praise God that nobody can endure us. Hallelujah. Oh, blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise his name. I told you I'll be short. Amen. Oh, praise his name. Hallelujah. This is why then, amen, big, but I'll just do it. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise his name. There's a few practical things. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise his name. So, of course, Amen. Fellowship is really, really wonderful. Amen. Praise his name. Because of the power of the blood. Amen. Praise God of Jesus. Then of course we can come boldly. Amen. In his presence. We can come boldly in his presence. Come on church. Because of the blood of Jesus. We can come boldly in his presence. Hallelujah. The writer to the Hebrews. Amen. Praise God. Give us. Amen. Praise God. Amen. A wonderful declaration. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. When you speak of the boldness. Amen. Praise God. To approach God. The boldness to approach God. Hallelujah. Brothers and sisters. Amen. And we need to really understand this. Praise his name. This will be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise his name. The boldness. Amen. That we have gotten to approach God. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Praise his name. Hallelujah. It's like no other. It's like no other. Amen. It's like no other. It caused the early church to stand before kings and rulers and speak with authority. Hallelujah. This will be the name of Jesus. That even in the book of Acts chapter 26. Hallelujah. Praise God when Paul were drawn before a grip and festus. Amen. Praise his name. Come on, church of God. 
Amen. When you were told you are privileged to speak for yourself. Come on, church of God. Hallelujah. Amen. My God, my God. The boldness was in the man. He says, look here. Amen. Praise God. I am happy for this. Amen. Say be the name of Jesus. Come on, brother and sister. And as he speak, amen, about the power, amen, that is in the blood of Jesus. The power that have changed him, turned him around. My God, my God. Come on, church. Amen. I think it was Festus that said, almost you persuade me to be a Christian. <laughs> Hallelujah. But the man of God says, not just almost. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the praying. And I hope that, of course, you were fully, amen, persuaded. Amen. There's power in the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. And not just you alone, but everyone. Amen. In the year in praise God, that scripture showed the importance of preaching the gospel. Come on, brothers and sisters. Everyone that hear it me. Hallelujah. Praise God. I pray God that they were touched and amen. Praise his name. They would have been persuaded that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise his name. Only these bands that I'm in, praise God. Amen. I would hope that, of course, amen, there is no repentance for them. Amen. No oh, praise his name. If we don't have any soul. Boldness. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise God. Amen. This word, of course, boldness is very important. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. This word, of course, it occurs about four times in the book of Hebrews. In Hebrews chapter 3, 14, we have seen the same word hackers and in chapter 4 16 and 10 19 and 10 35 blessed be the name of the lord sometimes it means of course um, it means sometimes bedrock belief bedrock belief or bold assurance amen bedrock belief church of god amen amen our bold assurance Talking about boldness. Hallelujah. Amen. Here, however, it's indicate, of course, authority. Amen. It indicates authority are being authorized and bold. So we are humble. Just like Jesus was humble even to the death of the cross. Amen. Praise his name. But also it means Praise his name. Freedom to enter the holiest place of God's presence because of the blood of Jesus. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Freedom to enter. Amen. The holiest, the most holiest of God's presence all because of the blood of Jesus. What a blessing. What a luxury. Amen. Upon sinful men and women, boys and girls like us today. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. Such access was not available under the whole covenant except once a year by one man, the high priest himself, your Lord. Amen. Praise God was able to, of course, enter. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters, the temple veil. Amen. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Praise his name. However, however, was of course this veil were torn in two praise his name at Jesus' death. This veil were torn in two at Jesus' death. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Darkness was up on the land. It was in that point as I said earlier. They said, surely this. Amen. Praise God. He was the Son of God. Oh, I mean, acknowledgement of to take place. Hallelujah. Something is about to happen. Amen. Something is about to happen again, church. Amen. Amen. Praise God. The veil that separates God's people from God's presence in 1020. Amen. Of Hebrews. This new and living way to God is now, of course, praise his name, thrown wide open by Jesus' sacrificial death. Amen. For all those who have faith in him. 
Praise his name and faith in the efficacy of his blood. Hallelujah. Praise his name. This blood, praise God, brought about its required result. Amen. It's all about washing, cleansing. Amen. The human race. Amen. From their sins. Amen. Praise God as Isaiah said, because he shall save his people from their sins. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Praise God. Amen. The efficacy of the blood. The efficacy of the blood brought about that required result. Amen. Praise God. That when, praise God, so many, amen, of us, amen, praise God, that are washed by his blood and when we look back into a whole life, amen, as Paul says, it is a shame. Amen. Even to speak of those things, amen, that we have done in darkness. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise his name. Amen. Praise his name. So, of course, we have fellowship. Amen. With God. Amen. Through the blood of Jesus Christ. And we need to understand this and count the cause. Amen. Because of the power of the blood of Jesus, you can come boldly into the presence of God, as we have just looked at. Amen. Amen. The blood of Jesus, it really builds a, a mighty wall between sin and the believer who have been made righteous. Amen. Or who have been made in his righteousness. Amen. Praise God. As also 2 Corinthians 5 21, amen, declare, for he. Amen. Or made him. Amen. Praise God. That of course was without sin. Praise God. Who know no sin. Amen. That in him. Praise God. Or that through him. We might be the righteousness of God. What a blessing. Oh praise his name. Amen. This is a great blessing. Praise his name. Praise God. We're talking about fellowship. Another word for fellowship is communion. Another word for fellowship is communion. And we, Church of God, we're acquainted with this one. Amen. Communion. Even the Holy Communion. Amen. Praise God. And there is something about the Holy Communion. There is something about, amen, the communion. Amen. Praise God. Praise God. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise His name. Sitting at the table, amen, blessed be the name of the Lord. There is something about, amen, this remembrance service that we are charged, amen, and we are told, amen, praise God. Come on, brothers and sisters, that in as often as we do this, we do show the Lord's death until he come. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise his name. And Deacon Thompson always speak very, very strongly and this. Amen. Praise his name. It's his word that always means strong and this. That we can forget our birthday. We can forget, of course. Amen. Praise his name. Probably we can forget the anniversary. Amen. Hallelujah. Even though Brother Mangle, she will get very rough when you forget her anniversary. But after all, it can make up. Amen. So be the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise his name and it is not as deep. Amen. Praise God. But we should not forget, amen, the finished work of the cross. Hallelujah. Let's be the name of Jesus. Come on, church of God. Let's be the name of Jesus. Amen. So, of course, also as we encourage, amen, our brothers and sisters, to always try and at home right now, come get it in your spirit. Amen. Talking about fellowship. Amen. And we're saying that, of course, another word for fellowship is communion. Yeah. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. The Lord's Supper. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Very important. Amen. One may recognize that the blood provided the fellowship with God through the taking of communion. Jesus said, do this in remembrance of me. 1 Corinthians eleven twenty-three. 23. Amen. To 26. Amen. That's why communion is much deeper. Yeah. Amen. Than a religious observance. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. We know that a lot of people, even into a church of God, amen, surrounding. Amen. Praise his name. Praise God. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. They just do this just for a religious 
Come on, brothers and sisters. Come on, come on. Amen. Praise God. Take it. Amen. Praise him, but it's very deep. As Deacon always says when he lives in Kingston, dear. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. Praise him, that lady. As we always bring out that. And right here, as we read this, we can, amen, I identify this, amen, with persons. Amen. There are many others like this. Amen. Praise him, that when it is coming up to the communion service, now, though she would curse and she would go on bad during the week. Come on, brothers and sisters. But when it is coming up to the communion service, you recognize, at least you recognize, this a fellowship <laughs> with the most high. Amen. So she would wipe her mouth and she would say, let me hold my peace here. Let me hold my mouth here. Because a communion service has come up. Come on, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise God. Should we continue in sin by the grace of God to abound? No. Amen. Praise God. The blood of paid. Amen. For that death. And we should not. Amen. Continue in sin. So at least she will recognize sin. Amen. If she's going to draw to the Lord's table, she's going to be taking communion. Then she must stay away from sin. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. And so then. Amen. That is why also we draw. Amen. This amen praise this name illustration many times when it says persons, amen, Christians should not, amen, praise God. Come on, should not, come on, church of God, amen, miss the communion service because also it draws nearer to God. And if we mean heaven, if we mean the kingdom, come on, church of God, if we mean to be with Christ, amen, then we need everything that brings us closer to God. To involve in it, to do it, to practice it. Amen. Praise God to be a part of it. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. But also in the same breath, I want to say many times because of course, even the Bible says we should examine ourselves. Amen. Praise His name and people examine themselves and find themselves guilty. Amen. But the mistake is brothers and sisters. Amen. This is the right time. This is the right time to say devil. Yes, I am guilty. I have grieved God. But Jesus Christ, amen. Praise his name. is speak the word. It is finished. It's paid. Amen. That's what communion service is about. Recognizing the power that is in the blood to wash every sinner, any sinner. Cleanse. Amen. Praise God. Any boy, any girl from their sins. Amen. Praise God. And as we go on and I go into the accusation. Bible class, I will go into that. Amen. Then, of course, really, that's where many Christians fall down. Amen. That's where they should really rise up. My God, and say, but after all, after all, I don't have to live this life. After all, I don't belong here. Amen. Praise God. After all, amen. Praise God. The price has been paid. After all, Jesus paid the debt he did not owe. I hold that debt that I could not pay. After all, come on, church of God. We must understand our right fellowship. After the resurrection, we must understand that it brings about fellowship with God and man. This will be the name of Jesus. Come on, come on. We are no underprivileged. Let us step up, amen, into our full redemption. Let us step up into the finished work of Calvary. Hallelujah. This will be the name of Jesus. Come on, brothers and sisters. Let us step up to the full redemptive work of Jesus Christ. Amen. The Son of God. Amen. That's why communion is much deeper than religious observance. It is a recognition of, amen, and fellowship with, amen, amen, that God did for us. Amen. Through the blood of Jesus, you are a friend of God, St. John 15, 15. Amen. Remember, Jesus and the disciples were talking. Amen. Let's look here. Amen. Henceforth, I call you not servant, but friends. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Henceforth, I call you not servant, but friends. What a fellowship. Come on, brothers and sisters. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Let it be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, praise God. We magnify God for the finished work of Jesus. We magnify God. Amen. Praise God for the price that Amen you have paid. And I want to encourage us with this understanding, with this access, with this boldness. 
with this right. Amen. Praise his name. I encourage us. Amen. Praise God to hold fast the profession of our faith or the confession of our faith that Jesus Christ is Lord. That Jesus Christ is the Savior of the world. That Jesus Christ redeem us from our sin. The confession of our faith. That we are no longer a slave to sin. Come on church of God. <laughs> Hallelujah. This is the confession of our faith. Amen. Praise God. No longer bound. Amen. No more chain holding us down. We have been free by the blood of Jesus Christ to walk as children of light. To walk as children. Amen. To have been cleansed by the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Praise his name. So we are encouraged. Amen. The writer to the Hebrews encourage us. Amen. Praise God. That of course we should hold fast this profession. Now as we hold this profession fast, we should not be selfish. Come on, church of God. Amen. Praise his name. We should not be selfish. Amen. And even though, of course, it's time to turn a yard on different things, but thank God. Amen. Praise God. Thank God for phone. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Thank God for. Amen. Praise God. All the other platforms. Amen. In which we can talk, we can communicate, we can still have fellowship. Hallelujah. So he said in the 24th verse of Hebrews chapter, Amen. Praise his name. Hallelujah. 10. Amen. Praise his name. And we, Amen, want to look at it. Amen. Praise God. Let us consider one another to provoke and to love and to good works. Let us consider one another, not just to be at home. Come on, at home, wherever you are. Amen. Just baptize. Don't even baptize yet. Amen. Amen. And for you out there that, amen, praise God, you don't even get your baptism yet, as we have some candidates. Hallelujah. Come on, church of God. Amen. Come on. Hold fast to your confession of faith in Christ. Amen. And as you hold fast, be sure, amen, that what you have gotten, what you have get through the blood of Jesus, that you are sharing it. In other words, amen, we have more time. Amen. Not to gossip. Amen. Not to gossip. Come on, church. Not to be, amen, praise God, spreading scandals. Amen. Praise his name. But what a beautiful time. What a loving time. Amen. amen. Praise God. To share the gospel with one another. To share the good news of salvation with one another. Amen. So the writer said, let us consider one another to provoke. Amen. Praise God. And to love and to good works. Hallelujah. And I love how this writer put it. And to love and to good work. Let me hear you say. And to love and to good work. Hallelujah. Amen. And God shows how to do it. Amen. If we say we love, amen, then we are going to really give. Amen. Hallelujah. So, amen. And to love and to good work, a lot of things come into this. Because as we have the close down, some people lost their job, some people don't have an income. Come on, church. Amen. Are we still in church? Amen. Are we still here? Are we still speaking about the power of the blood? Hallelujah. Amen. Some people don't have an income, so of course God bless us. Amen. Those of us that are still working, we can call up our loved ones. Amen. How are you making it? Amen. And not just to say how are you making it, make it plain. How are you making it financially? Amen. Amen. Sometimes we don't want to use that word. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Come on, church of God. To provoke one another in love and good works. Amen. Good works does not, amen, necessarily save us. Amen. Many of them. Amen. But of course, being saved, then we must do good work. Come on, brothers and sisters. Being saved, then we inquire for the welfare of others. Amen. And this was what touches God. In the book of Acts, what is it? 7, 8, 9. Amen. 9. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Praise his name. When God says, Amen, Cornelius, thy prayer, come on, church of God, thy prayer, Amen, have been heard, and thy arms come up before me as a memorial. Come on, church of God, the first Gentile house to be saved, Cornelius, come on, Amen, because of good work. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters, in the sense that is love. That is given. 
Amen. God, amen. Praise God. God is saying, Amen. Your arms of love, your arms of giving, of sharing, Amen. Come up before me as a memorial. Hallelujah. Come on, church of God. Amen. So in this lockdown, shutdown, I'm saying we have work to do. Amen. At home, at church, right now, I'm speaking to every one of us. It's everybody business. My God, so I might really, amen, praise God, amen, say something strange right now, amen. So even those, amen, of us that think that we are less fortunate, I am saying you find a way, you find a way, amen, praise God, to give to somebody out of your little, amen, find a way. Come on, brothers and sisters. I don't know if we understand that we're getting God's principle. Amen. Amen. When everybody, even though that was that say we are the least or we are the less. Amen. When you find a way to give, to inquire. Amen. To even pass on a word of comfort to others. God in his love and in his mercy. Come on brothers and sisters. We supply. Amen. All your needs according to his riches and glory. Come on. We all need to step up to the plate. Amen. Because amen, we're talking about fellowship with God through the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Praise his name. And I should have said in the opening that of course, amen, we're coming to you. Praise God from the equator faith mission church of God, Blackwoods, Florinda. Yes, say be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Say be the name of Jesus. Amen. And make a country church. Amen. Praise God. That as amen experience the power of the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. And we are not ashamed of this gospel. Amen. It has power. It has power. It has power. My God. My God. St. Luke. Before I go to St. Luke, it's with me. Then I had also amen, a very strange could be strange. Amen for some of us. Praise God. That is Exodus chapter 19. Exodus chapter 19. Just look at something in brief. In Exodus chapter 19, you would have seen in the third month when the children of Israel were gone forth out of the land of Egypt. The same day came they into the wilderness of Sinai. For they were departed from the children and were come to the desert of Sinai. And had pitch in the wilderness there. Okay. And there Israel, of course, camped before the mount. But these words from verse 3 of Exodus chapter 19, and I want to read them to verse 6. And Moses went up unto God, and the Lord called unto him out of the mountain, saying, Thus shalt thou say to the house of Jacob, and tell the children of Israel, ye have seen that I did, ye have seen what I did unto the Egyptians, and know, and now I bear you an eagle's wings. Hallelujah. Pray, church, in Nazare, to be the name of Jesus. Let's pray. Amen. Because, of course, I'm a very positive person. Praise his name, but I will not complain. Amen. I think when I stand here, Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Praise God. What is really taking place? Amen. Praise His name. But of course, Amen. God is good. And we believe in the finished work of Calvary and the blood. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. And through the power of the blood, Amen. We are drawn, we have been drawn nigh to the Lord. Praise His name. And I want you to get it as I read. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. Praise His name. Hallelujah. Verse 4, go back. He have seen what I did unto the Egyptians, and how I bear you an eagle's wings. Hallelujah. 
and brought you unto myself. Now, therefore, if he will obey my voice indeed and keep my covenant, then he shall be a peculiar treasure unto me above all people, for all the earth is mine. Hallelujah. My God. We're still talking about boldness. If we understand these things. Amen. Verse 6. And he shall be unto me a kingdom of priests and a holy nation. There, these are the words which thou shalt speak unto the children of Israel. And I want to read the verse 7. And Moses came and called for the elders of the people and laid before their face all these words which the Lord commanded him. Hallelujah. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Amen. Of course, this was for Israel, but there were God's peculiar churches. There is some symbolism and there is some things for us to understand. Amen. That of course, amen. Praise God. Anyone, anybody that is God's peculiar treasure. Amen. Praise his name. Praise God. We have to understand that of course we are peculiar. Hallelujah. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. So I want us to really understand that of course, amen. Praise his name. And because of time, what I want to do. Amen. Just a little. Amen. Praise God. In verse 19, as we have read, praise God. Chapter 19, as we have read. Amen. Record the establishment of God covenant with the people of Israel at Mount Sinai. The covenant is an extension of the covenant with Abraham and his descendants. Come on. I'm included. Hallelujah. Are we following? I want you to say, I'm included. Hallelujah. Praise his name. So we are saying that the covenant is an extension of the covenant with Abraham and his descendants. Genesis 15, 6, 18, 17, 7. Praise his name. And as the scripture. This covenant was based on Israel, pure, of course, reconciliation to God and their ungrowing fellowship with him, it's defined the condition by which Israel would remain God's treasure. Amen. The condition which they would remain God's treasure. Amen. Or his treasured position. Amen. Continue in his blessings and carry out, of course, his will for the nation. Genesis 12.2. Amen. God intended that Israel be a peculiar people. It was God's intention that Israel wake up, brothers and sisters. Amen. I don't intend to put you to bed, but I want us to look into the word. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. To be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Amen. People chosen and set apart to him for his purpose. The people were to respond in obedience and gratitude to God by seeking to keep the commandments as it were. Amen. And by offering the prescribed sacrifice. Amen. Praise God. Of God's covenant. As a result, they would be a kingdom of priests who were holy, pure, set apart. Amen. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Come on, church of God. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. And so, amen. Praise God. We have come into this. We have come under this. Because, amen, it were for the descendants of Abraham. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Kingdom of priests in verse 6. Amen. What a blessing that we can go boldly to the throne of God. Boldly. Let me just say boldly. Come on, brothers and sisters. Don't have to go to the pastor, the deacons, the evangelists. Come on! Hallelujah. We can go boldly to the throne of God because we are now priests. Amen. And kings of the most high God. Amen. We are drawn nigh. We have been made priests. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. The curtain 
Hallelujah, brothers and sisters have been removed. Amen have been torn. And the door is open wide. Hallelujah. For everyone to enter in. Come on, church of God. The door is open. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. And now we are priests, verse 6. Kingdom of priests and holy nation. As part of God's purpose for the Israelites in bringing them out of Egypt. They were to be, amen, praise God. They were to be a kingdom of priests that is set apart. Amen. Consecrated for God. Amen. Service. Amen. Praise God. Paul put it this way. Praise God. Amen. Praise his name. Romans 12. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Present yourself. Amen. As a living sacrifice. Holy and acceptable unto God. Which is your, which is my reasonable service. The only reasonable service that we can really give. Amen. Is presenting this body of ours. Come on, church of God. Surrender to the King of glory. Surrender to the King of glory. Amen. Praise God. By telling Satan, Amen, I'm no longer bound. Hallelujah. By telling Satan, I'm a new creation. By telling Satan, any man in Christ is a new creature. All things are passed away. Be all looking to it. Amen, I'm a new creation. All things become new. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. We have been drawn nigh by the precious blood of Jesus Christ. No longer bound. Hallelujah. We don't have to serve the devil. We don't have to live in sin. Because of the blood of Jesus Christ. That draws into fellowship with God and man. Hallelujah. 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 Let me close. And I know no was might have think why would I leave out the first portion of St. Luke this week so much as I said before. St. Luke chapter 24 because I intend to deal with fellowship to show us that of course really, amen, we are included. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus Christ. Praise his name. In the book of St. Luke chapter 24, Amen. Praise his name. A lovely book and Luke, a great writer. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Physician, intelligent writer. And he shows that it was upon the first day of the week and all of that. We know all of these things. Amen. Praise God. It was very early in the morning when they have gone to the sepulchre. Amen. Praise God. But as one of us was saying, the moderator, Amen. Praise God. He's not here. My God. If he was there, we would have been in trouble. Thank God he wasn't there. Come on, brothers and sisters. Thank God he wasn't there. Come on, church of God. Hallelujah. Let be the name of Jesus. Your mother Thompson was praying this prayer. Amen. In the Good Friday service that one taken from the book of Mark. Because these writers, they're different in their style. Amen. Let be the name of Jesus. The woman was going, but one trouble they had. Amen. One trouble was on their mind. Amen. Who shall roll us away this storm? Hallelujah. Come on, church of God. I'm closing. Come on. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. My God. My God. Amen. But to your surprise, to your amazement. Amen. When they reach. Amen. Amen. The storm was already rolled away. Hallelujah. My God. The power of the blood. Blessed be the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Praise his name. So we're in Luke. Yes, so we have had. Amen. Praise his name. First part there, lovely part. But we start from the verse 30. And we're looking at the walk to. Amen. Hemios. Amen. And why I'm going here. Amen. Is that of course, my brothers and sisters, this was a good walk. This was a holy walk. It was a sincere walk. Hallelujah. Let be the name of Jesus. Amen. All because of the blood of Jesus Christ. So we know this story well. It was read. So I'm not going to it again. Amen. Let be the name of Jesus. Amen. But this walk in the Hemius Road of 
some things for us to observe. Hallelujah. Say so be the name of Jesus. Amen. Firstly, amen. Two person. Amen. One of the name is given. Clear, clear pass. Amen. Amen. Praise his name. And the other name was not given. Amen. So we have nothing much to say on that. Amen. Praise his name. Somebody said, and we could have said that also, probably it was his wife. Amen. But it was Cleopas' wife. Amen. We know that. Name was not given. Amen. The verse 18. Come on, brothers and sisters. Praise his name. But of course, what I love is this really fellowship. With, of course, amen, Cleopas, and whosoever was there with him, and the risen Christ. Hallelujah. And the risen Christ. Amen. Praise his name. This journey could have been seven, a seven mile journey. Come on, brothers and sisters. Praise his name. Amen. Praise God. But of course, there was on this journey because he is risen. Hallelujah. Praise his name. But of course, what we observe here is that Jesus drew nigh. Why? Because the conversation was good. Yes. Amen. No wonder, amen. The Bible declares and says, let your conversation, amen, praise God, be seasoned with grace. Amen. Let your conversation be one that cannot be condemned. Praise his name. Come on. Home zero at home. Zero everywhere. We are. Come on. Amen. Because many times as church of God, people as Christians. Amen. Present our conversation is not good. Amen. But we will learn from this that when our conversation is good. Amen. When it is empty. Amen. It is about kingdom purpose. Amen. Praise his name. Then Jesus will join us. And I believe with all of my heart. That every one of us would want Jesus to be in our conversation. Come on, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise his name. Amen. So they were talking and Jesus joined and he asked them a question and they asked him, but are you a stranger? Because only a stranger would have not heard, amen, of what take place. Amen. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Only a stranger would have not heard it. Amen. Praise his name. But of course, amen. Hmm. Jesus asked them what thing and they declared. Amen. And it was good. The declaration was good. Amen. So they declared Jesus of Nazareth. Hmm. Okay. The verse 19, I read it. And he said unto them, what thing? And they said unto him, concerning Jesus of Nazareth, which was a prophet, mighty. Come on mighty indeed and words before God and all the people what a conversation amen amen good words healthy words sincere words hallelujah blessed be the name of Jesus amen praise God and how the chief priests and what they have done to him but we have to get down and close amen praise his name amen praise God amen the verse 22. Yea, and certain women also of our company made us astonished. Amen. Which went early to the sepulchre and they were giving Jesus the history of what take place. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. The good news. My God. Hallelujah. Praise his name. My God. And how we have seen the vision of angel and the angels declare to them, he is risen. Come on, brothers and sisters. But what I want to really get into, amen, praise his name, praise God, is that, of course, the verse 25, amen, where Jesus, the verse 25, amen, then he said unto them, this is Jesus, O oh, foolish and slow of heart, to believe all that the prophets have spoken. Art not Christ to have suffered these things? And to enter into his glory. And if we read and if we follow when we are reading, we say, My Lord, that was such a lovely conversation. Yet Jesus used the word. How foolish. <laughs> My God. And for us, it would seem like an insult, huh? 
Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. We were talking about the power of the blood. Amen. The fellowship through the blood. Amen. Let's be the name of Jesus. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Yet they were very calm. Didn't upset. We have not read anything that they were upset. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. But of course, what we must take into consideration here is that, of course, when they, verse 27 says, And beginning at Moses and all the prophets, he expounded unto them in all the scriptures. Amen. The things concerning himself. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Praise God. So what take place here? They have a Bible class. Come on, brothers and sisters. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Fellowship. The blood. What I'm about to say here. Hallelujah. Brothers and sisters. Is what, of course, sadly to say. Many of our church of God, of course, congregation. Amen. We have, amen, so many persons that do not take, my God, pride and interest in Bible class. Amen. Come on, church of God. Amen. The Bible says that the people perish in Uzziah. Amen. Because of lack of knowledge. Knowledge is through the word. Written word, spoken word. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. To reading books. Amen. To having conversation. Even watching films. Amen. We gain knowledge. Amen, church of God. Amen. What I want to say, Jesus used the, this word because, of course, really, I think it really touched him. Because the way they were emphasizing and they were speaking well of him. Amen. But yet what touched Jesus, if we can understand this lesson, amen, is that they were lack knowledge. Come on, brothers and sisters. The way they were illustrating it to him, the way they were saying it to him, they were lacking the word. You don't get that. So that's why I read this portion. Amen. To bring out to us because we know all about the resurrection and everything, but we need to get into this. Amen. What grieved Jesus? What grieved Jesus? Come on, brothers and sisters. In when we are lacking the word. So that is why the verse 27, and he began at Moses and all the prophets coming down, he expounded unto them in all the scriptures. Amen. The thing concerning himself. My God. Come on, because he find out that, of course, amen, even yes. Amen. They felt it for him and everything, but they lacked some knowledge about the prophets, about Moses, about all that they had said. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. So that's why he used the word, amen, praise his name, to them, to help them here. So they have a Bible class, Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. So I'm saying, brothers and sisters, out there at home, wherever you are, Amen. Let us be a part of Bible study Sunday school. Amen. We have to find a way also to get this Sunday school online. Let's be the name of Jesus. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Let us really get into the Word of God. Fellowship I'm talking about. But I'm using, of course, Amen. Praise God. This, this, this disciple, you could say it was a disciple, but not one of the twelve. At this point, we say one of the eleven. Come on, brothers and sisters, because Judas is out of it. Amen. This, of course, play past that left. Amen. Take his journey with the other companion. Was not one half Jesus' 11 disciples. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. So what really touches me as I read this, amen, praise God. Jesus joined into a conversation, amen, praise God, with amen, amen, praise God, two persons, that was none of those that was close to him. The first, come on, praise his name, man that he joined with was none of them that was close to him. In the sense, after that he have chosen, dine with, amen. Teach and says, you go into the world and, amen, praise God, do all that you have seen me do and so on. Amen, was none of them. We will not get deep into that. But of course, if we would read verse 33 to 35, praise God. And they rose up the same hour after Jesus made himself known to them by breaking bread. In that part we skip out. Amen. Fellowship again. Amen. Fellowship. Come on, church of God. Breaking bread with them. My God. 
My God. You really want to read that, but let me go. Amen. So we know this story there. Highs hoping after he had blessed. Amen. Praise his name. Them and after he had blessed it and break it and gave to them in verse 30. Amen. They recognized that this was Jesus. So when they recognized that this was Jesus, then they said, My God, didn't that our heart burn within us? Come on, come on, come on. We quote this many times. Did not our hearts burn within us? What really burns your heart? Amen. The Bible class. <laughs> oh, you don't get it. I hope you're getting it. Amen. Amen. No, let I read the word. At home, at home. Amen. Praise his name. Praise God. What touches and what will really get into depth. Amen. Into our hearts and into our system is the word of God. Amen. What will change us, what will make us. Amen. Able and capable people, qualified people is the word of God. Hallelujah. What will cause us to enjoy church is the word of God. Hallelujah. What will help us to enjoy fellowship with one another is the word of God. Amen. And I keep on saying, people that cannot fellowship, you lack the word. Come on, brothers and sisters. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. When we have the word, we will have fellowship with God and with one another. Hallelujah. Oh, blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise his name. And I really want us to get it. Amen. I should have said, and I'm going to read it, verse 29. I have to backtrack. So while they have that lovely conversation, that lovely Bible class, it's sweet then. They enjoy it. Their hearts burn within them. Come on, church. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. When we are in trouble, Amen. We don't know what to do as they were on a journey. Amen. And they were wondering what become of Jesus. Amen. But the word, come on church of God. The word of Jesus from Moses, from the prophet, the holy scripture, bring them to a place. Amen. That they forget about their trouble. Come on brothers and sisters. Amen. And they were now enjoying fellowship. Amen. With the master true Bible study. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. So they drew nigh and I still have to back chalk. It's a bad thing to try to be rushing the word of God. Amen. Praise his name. The verse 28. And they draw nigh unto the village whether they went and he made as though he would have gone further. That is, that is Jesus. But it was now late. Amen. So these two of course, the person that he had the Bible class with, but they constrain him, saying, Abide with us, for it is, amen, towards evening, and the day is already for spent, the day and night are come. Amen. And he went in to tarry with them. Come on, church of God. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. My God, Jesus is that they love the word. Amen. And he's the teacher of the word. Amen. Praise God. So he went into the tower with them. Remember Paul and others. Amen. Praise his name. As they would have preached and teach the gospel. He says that of course the people restrain him to tarry. Even praise God beyond his schedule. Amen. Praise God. We have seen that in the scripture. In the, in the epistle, in the life of Paul. Amen. And they have Bible class. Amen. Pray to his name. Fellowship, fellowship, fellowship. Amen. I know it might be strange to a lot of us. Amen. Praise God. What am I saying? But I want us to get it. Read it. Get it for yourself. Amen. Praise his name. They constrain him. Amen. So they were so persistent. When they use the word constrain, that means that you not just go like that. They have said some things to him. Amen. As the Bible also says, if everything was written, then there was no book. There would be no book to hold it. So let us bear that in mind. Amen. Amen. So we must believe that they said some things to Jesus. Amen. About the Bible class, about being in his presence. Remember, they are strangers. They did not, amen, know that it is Jesus. Remember, they are strangers. Yet they were in joy. They were having fellowship because of the word. The word brings fellowship. Hallelujah. The word causes us to enjoy each other. Hallelujah. And I stand a living testimony wherever I go. 
I always sought out for Bible class. Amen. Amen. Praise his name. And I can testify, I can tell you, amen, that sit into, amen, Bible class and listen to the word, amen, then you just have fellowship with these persons, amen, that you have seen for the very first time. But the way they share the word, hallelujah, the baby can leap in your womb, amen, that this is a Bible church, amen, this is a, amen, praise God, amen, church that believe in righteousness, amen, that believe in the kingdom of God, in the principle of God. This is a church that present themselves to God as living sacrifice. Come on, church of God. Amen. So they will enjoy the word. So they would with, uh, constrain Jesus and he tarried. Amen. Let's be the name of the Lord. So after everything, Jesus Christ said, well, it's full time. And he break bread and then he vanished out of their sight. Amen. Amen. And then they took their journey. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. They took their journey from Jerusalem to, of course, uh, amen, praise his name, Emmaus, hmm? which is about seven miles. Amen, praise God. But they were on their journey and they were wondering, praise God, and they were thinking. But of course, the verse 23, and there was up the same hour, returned to Jerusalem and found the elders gathered together and them that were with them. The verse 34, saying, the Lord is risen indeed. And as my God appeared to, of course, Simon, what a good tidings. They are personally identified with the risen Savior. And they were the ones that were bringing the news to the chosen. Amen. Eleven that now assemble. Come on, church of God. Amen. Because they were not excluded. Hallelujah. That be the name of Jesus. It's also a sure sign to show that he come for one, he come for all, is no respecter of person. Hallelujah. Let's be the name of the Lord. But I said earlier, it was not any of the eleven. The verse 35. And they told what things were done in the way, as they were traveling on the way, right? And they talked together with Jesus and having that Bible cross. They, they, they speak of everything. Amen. And how oh, he was known of them in breaking of bread. In breaking of bread. And as Jesus spoke, Jesus himself stood in the midst of them and said unto them, Peace be unto you. But they were terrified and frightened. And of course, Suppose that they have seen my God. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Amen. Suppose that they have seen a spirit, or a dove, would say. Amen. Come on, brothers and sisters. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. But of course, amen, would have read, 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 of, uh, read here that of course when they Go down there and catch the news. The eleven disciples were assembled together. Amen. So be the name of Jesus. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. So of course, amen. Praise his name. Let us stand. Let us stand. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise his name. Hallelujah. Praise God. We must understand if we come in contact with Jesus Christ, the Savior of the world. If we come in contact with Jesus Christ, the giver of life. Hallelujah. Amen. If we come in contact with Jesus Christ, Amen. Praise His name. Praise God. The one that draws out of darkness into His marvelous light. Amen. We must fellowship. We must have fellowship. Hallelujah, church. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. Praise God. No matter. Amen. Praise God. Amen. We have not known each other. Amen. Praise God. Over the years are. Amen. We have not acquainted with each other, but when, amen, the blood, when the blood, amen, reaches our heart, it changes our behavior. Hallelujah. Amen. Changes our style. Amen. Present, give us a spirit of worship, of adoration, of fellowship. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen. Praise his name. I am imploring us today. Amen. Praise God through the death, burial, and resurrection of Jesus Christ. That it is possible to fellowship one with another. Amen. I am imploring us today. Amen. That it is the will of God. The writer to the Hebrews 10, 25. Amen. 
Don't forsake him. Amen. The assembling of yourself one toward the other. Amen. Even as the manner of some is. Amen. So even in this online service, I pray God. Amen. That you take the time out. Amen. To fellowship. Amen. Take the time out. To get in the presence of God. Take the time out to read in your Bible. Follow in, the, in your Bible. Follow in the scripture. Because the word is of most importance in this Christian walk. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Oh, praise this wonderful name. Amen. And I encourage us. Amen. Praise God. To stand fast into this liberty. Wherein Christ hath made us free. And be not again entangled ourselves in the yoke of bondage. Sin, sin of bondage, sin of bondage, come on. Sin of bondage, amen. The work of the flesh, come on. Amen, we are declaring, amen, that the work of the flesh must go. Come on, brothers and sisters. Amen, it's bondage. Amen, praise his name. Amen, we believe in life. We believe in the power of the spirit. We believe, praise God, amen, in the work of the spirit. Hallelujah. Come on, brothers and sisters. We believe in the fruit of the spirit. Amen. Praise God. Joy, righteousness, love in the Holy Ghost. Come on, brothers and sisters. That's the kingdom of God. We must share it. Amen. Praise this wonderful name. We must believe it. We must encourage it. Let us provoke. Let us provoke one another in as much as we can see for ourselves that the coming of the Lord back to earth. Amen. Back. Amen. In the here to receive us out of this troubled world. Amen. It is nigh at hand. Hallelujah. Let us take this platform. Use this platform. Use these, of course, privileges. Amen. To encourage, to enlighten. Amen. One another. And to encourage one another. Amen. Praise God. Amen. To fellowship. Hallelujah. Let's have the name of Jesus. Praise his wonderful name. Praise God. And we must find ways and means how to have the communion service. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Because, of course, this is very vital, very important. Amen. In this time. Hallelujah. Praise God. So let us really learn to really fellowship. Amen. Praise his name. And for many that was missing out. Amen. I pray God. Amen. That, of course, amen. When this pass, as I said before, it will pass. And God must be glorified. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Amen. I encourage us this pass. Then, of course, be sure. Amen. Praise his name. Amen. That you use up the time. Amen. Paul. Yes, Paul was the one that said that, of course, in one of the epistles. Amen. Praise God. I've said it. Amen. That we must redeem it the time. For the days are evil. That always says that word there in redeem the time. Mean back to die back. Amen. Amen. Meaning that, of course, what we hear people say in their testimony service. One thing I sorry I did not start before. Come under that knowledge and saying, Amen. So in redeeming the time, Amen, because the days are evil, mean men to use up every platform, every opportunity, Amen, that we get to call, to encourage, to find out how others are going. Use it up. Amen. Use it up. Redeeming the time. Make up the time. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Praise God. Even time when you would not have been coming to church, praise his name, but of course, been, of course, again, get the privilege, use up the time. Amen. Let's have the name of Jesus. Praise God. So God bless you one and all today. God keep you sweet. Amen. Praise God in my clothes. And I want to say that the blood cleanses us from our sins. Wherever you are, praise God. Dear, you're a sinner right now. Amen. We want for you to understand that you are included. You are included. Praise his name. And as we bring the service to a close, praise God. We'll be handing back to the moderator in the short term. I want for you, praise God, to bow your heads right now and to believe God in the house. Praise his name. Let us believe God for our loved ones, for our families, for our children. My God, hallelujah. Praise God. There is many that are still in bondage. Hallelujah. Do not know what to do. But today, through the blood of Jesus Christ, they can be cleansed. 
Holy Spirit, hallelujah. Father, we praise you, we honor you, we adore you. Thank you for your cleansing blood. Thank you for Calvary. Thank you for the resurrection to our hope. My God, as Paul writes the case of the Corinthian church, that if you had not risen, yes, Lord, then our preacher, our testimony, my God, would be in vain. So we thank you for resurrection and to know that you are the resurrection and you are the life. We thank you for this life that you have given us. That was, oh God, this life that was lost through the rebellion and through disobedience of Adam and Eve. That through your precious blood, oh, thank you, Jesus. Then once more, God, we are reconciled to you in fellowship and friendship. Thank you for this peace. Hallelujah. My God, we thank you. We exalt you for this peace that you now give us. We can be called the sons of God. Now, Lord God, for our friends at home, around the house, wherever they are, in the, oh God, call, we have them that have not yet opened their hearts to you. But right now, God, are between two opinions, contemplating what to do. We know, God, there are many know, God, that yes, you are the resurrection and you are the life. Many know, God, that the wages of sin is death. But that deceiver are holding them captive. Come on, church of God. Hallelujah. Right now, Lord, we stand in the gap for them. My God, deceiving your, oh God, people, this deceiver, that they have yet enough time that they can still linger in sin. They can still, my God, continue where they are. My God, and they still have in this hope that yes, someday I'll be giving my life to the Lord. Father, in your finished work of Calvary and Calvary, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, we stand in the gap for everyone that have not yet confessed you as their Lord and Savior right now, wherever they are. We know, God, there are many that do come even to your house of worship. They fellowship with us, Lord. They come out to your house, Lord, but they are not saved. Right now at home, many of them listening, our children, my God, Sunday so school scholars, great and small, in the name of Jesus, we pray for their soul salvation because, my God, we know it's an awful picture standing outside. A day is coming, Lord God, when mercy will be gone. Judgment come. My God, it can be today. My God, we know not when. But today, Lord, what a blessing that right now, wherever they are, they can open their hearts to you. They can open their mouth and confess, Lord, I am a sinner. Yes, Lord, I sorry for my sins. I confess my sins. Lord, I turn away from my sins and my wicked ways. Lord, help them. To come to that place of acknowledgement. The name of Jesus. There are some backsliders. In the name of Jesus. And right now Lord. Yes Lord. My God. The place where they are are not comfortable. Place where they are are messy. In the name of Jesus. Their condition. My God is sickening and they know it. My God. But right now. Allow them to understand Lord. That right now by faith. They can reconcile to you, dear Savior. Like my God, the prodigal son. My God looked into himself and said, I will arise, go to my father, and I will confess to my father. Father, I am no more worthy to be called your son. I have destroyed myself. My God, I have grieved you. I have grieved my brothers and sisters. I have grieved my family. Come on, church. In the name of Jesus, my God, right now, Lord, because of Calvary, because of your blood, they don't have to live in sin. They don't have to continue in sin. They don't have to stay under the devil's accusation, my God, because of what they have done. But they can pull themselves out like my God, the prodigal son, in humility and submission. 
I will arise. Go to my father right now. Rise up some backsliders right now. Speak to the backsliders, Lord, right now. Restore them your joy. Restore them your peace. Restore them your fellowship. In the name of Jesus. We know not, Lord, if there will be another online service or in-house service. We only hope to. My God, but one thing we know, you are, you are, you are coming back to hurt. We know this is sure. Father, and your word to us is that today, if we hear your voice, we should not harden our hearts. Right now, God, I pray that your children, your people, that you died for, will not harden their hearts. They will open their hearts and receive you as their Lord and their Master. The church say, Amen. Amen. Thanks be to God. Hallelujah. Praise his name. Praise God. We want to get back to the moderator for closing. So be the name of Jesus. Announcement and closing. Moderator. So be the name of Jesus. So praise God. Friendship with Jesus. What a fellowship we divine. Oh, what a blessing. Communion. Jesus is a friend of mine. Oh, friendship with Jesus. Fellowship divine.
Amen. As we have fellowship, amen. Sure, amen. The blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. It is His blood that can bring us back into fellowship with God. We praise the name of the Lord. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. God bless. Amen. Man servant. Amen. As we bring the word of God to us today. Amen. To show us, amen, the fellowship. Amen. That God has bring us back into. Amen. With him. We praise the name of the Lord. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. God bless the man of God. Amen. As we continue. Amen. To expand the word of God unto his children. Amen. And we all have been blessed by the word today. Amen. So let's lift your hands and give God the glory. Amen. For his word to our hearts. Amen. And wherever you are, let's lift your hands and give him praise and glory and honor. That he still loved us. He's still mindful of us. God bless your church. Amen. As you go from day to day, we go in the strength and the power of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. We praise the name of the Lord. Amen. We're going to ask Sister Isham to come and pray the closing prayer. And if there is an announcement also, Amen. She, Amen, will bring it. Amen. In Jesus' name. Bless the name of the Lord as she comes. Praise his name. Hallelujah. Please stand and be with me in prayer as we close. Father God, we worship your name. We exalt you this afternoon, Jesus. We magnify your name, Lord. We give you thanks. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you honor. Thank you, Father God, for a wonderful day in your house, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father God, for this fellowship, Lord God. Thank you, mighty God, for dying on the cross, dear God. And Father God, that because of your dying and you rose again from the dead, we can have fellowship with you. We can have relationship with you, mighty God. Father God, we, oh God, have inherited, dear God, the blessed Lord Jesus. That today, God, we can have sweet fellowship, mighty God, in your presence. Thank you for your words today, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father God, for the fellowship. Thank you, mighty God, for your presence. Thank you, Father God, for your power. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for your servant, Lord God, who may have used, dear God, truly, God, so that we can really feed today, God. We can really fellowship, God. We can really learn of you today, mighty God. We give you thanks, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for this privilege, mighty God. Thank you, God, for your presence, King Jesus. Thank you, Father God, that we are not bound, dear God. But today, God, we are free to worship. We are free to fellowship. We are free to give you thanks, mighty God. We are free, mighty God, to really worship and to praise your name. Today, God, we give you thanks, God. We are grateful for this opportunity, mighty God. Thank you, Father God, for what you have done for us, mighty God, so that we can be free today, God. Thank you, Father God, that Father God from us. Thank you for Sunday morning, Lord God. Thank you, mighty God. You are risen from the dead, and you are Lord. And we give you thanks this morning, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father God, for everything, Lord Jesus. And as we go, Lord, I pray that Father that you will go with us, God. Be with us, Lord God. Can you cover us under your blood, Lord Jesus? And Father God, we may be worshiping mighty God separately, but God, through your blood, we are one. Through your blood, God, we can still fellowship as one people. Thank you, Father God, for today. Let your divine will plan and purpose be done in our lives, mighty God. At home, oh God, where we are in your house, are where we are, Lord God. Where we tune in today, Lord God. Let us, God, let these words, mighty God, really rest with us, Lord Jesus. Thank you to bless and keep us, Father God. We will give you thanks and praise. Honor and glory for your wonderful name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Bless the Lord. Hallelujah. For um, notice is 5 p.m. 5 p.m. later, those who receive the call come out at 5 p.m. Remember to be on time, 5 to 7.30. And for tomorrow, it's still curfew for those who get a call for tomorrow. And for the rest of the week, remember to be fasting. So um, for the rest of the days, it's just for today and tomorrow that you need um, 
a letter, but for the rest of the day, they still on the 12th. I remember it's fasting and prayer in the house of God for the week. God bless you. God bless you. And remember, those who have your savings, your offering, you can send it out. Your savings, your offering, your tithes, you can send it out. God bless you. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. <laughs> yes. Uh, I'm surprised. You're right on the board.